Talk CMS schools moving forward with the plan to expand access to the opioid reversing drug Narcan. The district's policy committee voted this morning to equip and train school employees in administering it. Right now, only school resource officers employed by CMPD are trained for this, so making this change would require modifying the first aid and emergency medical care policy. The decision will now go before the full school board for a vote. One CMS parent calls this idea of having Narcan to be more accessible a safety net, and that's after losing her teenage daughter to an overdose. Olivia Maloney was just 14 years old when she died, and her mother, Tamara Elstad, says she believes the district needs to expand access to the drug. But she has questions surrounding how school leaders will implement the plan if approved, including what kind of coaching would school employees receive to identify if a student is starting to overdose. She also tells WBTV she wonders what kind of underlying message may be sent once Narcan is available. Are we sending uh, the message to children that now school is a safe place to use drugs because they have an out in the event that something is to happen to them? She also encourages parents to be invasive when it comes to asking their kids about drugs, and she pleads with students who know about friends doing drugs to please anonymously report them to an adult.